How to apply to a postdoc position? Do you wonder how to apply for a postdoc position? If so, a suitable postdoc job is already a hassle, but the application can be trickier. In this video, we will provide you with all the necessary advice for preparing your application for a postdoc job. What does a postdoc position mean? A postdoctoral position is a type of employment that is typically offered to scientists and scholars who have recently completed their doctoral degree. A postdoc position is a job in which an individual may work with a group of people who are more senior than they are, on projects that are more advanced than they were able to complete during their graduate studies. A postdoc position can also be used as a stepping stone towards becoming an independent scientist or scholar. Some expert advice for preparing your application for a postdoc job. Postdoc is a time-consuming process that requires extensive research and dedication, so it's important to prepare yourself ahead of time. This video provides helpful tips, advice, and resources to make the process less stressful. How to prepare your curriculum vitae CV? Like any other job, the first and the required document for application to any postdoc vacancy is a CV. But, the format of the CV, unlike an industrial job, does not generally have any page limit. That means you can list all the essential track records and achievements in your CV. In general, you are expected to include the list of your publications in your CV, but there are some cases that the employer asked to upload your list of publications as a separate file. We advise you on what not to include in your CV. It is rather silly to include things such as your hobby, for example cycling, reading books etc. The employer is not interested in your personal hobbies. But make sure to include your awards, your tutorial activities, your co-supervision during your PhD, and your teaching activities. How to prepare your application letter, also known as cover letter? Apparently, the application letter is among the top parts of a job application where you express yourself and inform the employer about your intention for the application, your interest and background. To prepare your letter, you should carefully read the job description to make sure what is the expectation of the employer. Then, you should skim through the publication of the host professor and try to find one or two papers that fit your background and related to the subject of the post. The difficult job is to assemble that information in a letter. You can start the letter with a short statement about yourself and intention for application to that post. For example, I am writing to apply for the position of postdoctoral vacancy in the School of Science at University of Auckland. The next paragraph should be about your background. For example, I have graduated from the University of Leeds in September 2019. My PhD was about the synthesis of 2D materials under the supervision of Professor John Mayer. The project was rather successful and resulted in four peer-reviewed journal publications, two conference papers and one poster awards. You can find the list of my publications in the attached CV. During my PhD, I gained valuable hands-on experience in working with CVD, characterization tools such as SEM, TEM and electrical measurements. You can elaborate a bit more on that if you want but we would advise you to keep it short and concise. Now it is the time to explain how your background and expertise fit to the job description. Given the three years of experience in chemical vapor deposition, I believe that I can handle and manage quickly to be master of sputtering which is essential to the position. My experience with vacuum system can be a great asset in order to help your group in maintaining your vacuum-based facilities. Please note that the example above is very short and you can write much more than that and provide further details. How to write the closing statement of the application letter? At the end of your letter, you can express your interest in working on the project and mention that you are happy for an in-person interview. Thank you for watching this video. If you like the content, please do not forget to like it. Please leave your questions as comment below. We would be happy to have you as a subscriber of our channel, so please subscribe not to miss any new videos.